Oh boy. Today, I found something even more interesting. And it's so much more interesting that it gets so tiring. Because politicians who are most likely on the right, I assume Christy Mohem is, I assume, then, like, she responds to a tweet from March 26, saying, well, I'll, I'll just read the headline of, of what uh, it's been said on Twitter, which says, Melona X tells South Dakota Governor Christine Nunn to do, to her, do her job after she responded to news that the rapper is releasing Satan Shoes by saying that kids, God-given eternal soul is more inclusive than the release. Christy, Governor Christina, our kids are being told that this kind of product is not only okay, it's exclusive. But do you know what's more exclusive? Exclusive? Their God-given eternal soul. We are in a fight for the soul of our nation. We need to fight hard and we need to fight smart. We have to win. And here are the shoes from Saint, from Saint's Twitter account. And uh, yeah, that might be basically it here. And this person quoted on us who said, your whole, your whole governor, and you on here tweeting the some damn shoes. Do your job. And this guy who tweeted over that tweet says, "Was not expecting beef between Christina and Lona's ex on the timeline today." I mean, he's right. I'm not, I was not expecting this either. However, I don't think my locations were turned on 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 this portion here of the uh, Twitter website because it automatically gets disabled for obvious reasons when I'm not using Twitter as much. And it's kind of weird too. I mean, I'm just glad Lil Nas X told her off. It's kind of disappointing that some people would worry about some dumb shoe. I mean, seriously. Governor Christie Nunn should know better and should not be wasting a whole tweet talking about a rapper's shoe. Like, are you really that that attention hungry for for conversation starter, Governor Christine? Are you really that attention hungry for a conversation for a conversation starter? Because from what I'm seeing in this tweet that you made about Anas X's shoes, you are got to be the most brain dead governor. I have ever heard. Please. Please. Do what he says and do your job. You don't need to do this. Seriously. You don't need to do this. By the way, I wasn't gonna mention it, but I think Lil Nas X meant to say or like uh like W-H-O-R-E or I think he meant to say whore, not whole. Like, you're a whore, governor. And you on here tweeting about some damn shoes. Do your job. I think that's what he was going to say. Not, you're a whole governor and you're on here tweeting about some damn shoes. Do your job. So, but anyway. Yeah. Governor Christine Noam is a whore. And she needs to know that whatever she tweet, she may tweet about does not mean it's 
it's technically progress for her to be tweeting and stuff like this. If you're gonna tweet tweet about politics, you you know something that is worthy of uh, actually tweeting about the issues in your state. You do not tweet about some, some damn shoes from across the country. And Governor Christine Nunn really should look into it. Like, really. Cancel culture is when the governor of the state with one of the highest COVID deaths per capita is more worried about winning the battle with the Paranaki shoes than winning the battle to save her own constituents' lives. As said by Bright and Tyler Cole. Thank you. And Patterson says she harassed the indigenous tribes on tribal land about their measures to protect against COVID, but told mayors to handle it how they wanted. She vetoed industrial hemp that even the farmers wanted, but passed putting in God we trust in public schools. Call her out. If you really care about kids, why would you sign a bill that bans trans girls from sports and requires kids to provide invasive information about their bodies to the government? All kids deserve protection and inclusion. Yeah, exactly. I mean, come on. Governor Christine Nunn should not be worrying about a shoe. She should be worrying about the real issues in our country. And I'm sad to see this tweet. When I saw when I saw Luna Nas trending from from this stupid governor right here, because yes, she is stupid. She's a South Dakotan, but she's stupid. I mean, come on, Governor Christina, you're a stupid woman governor. You can't do anything right. Can you please, please focus on bigger issues rather than? Worrying about some shoes from a rapper who made his big debut in 2019. Can you just worry about that? Seriously, you're an idiot if you don't. Man, people these days they need to get a life, and Governor Christian unfortunately does not have a life because she. Went on tweeting about something that isn't really important to her state, and she hasn't deleted that tweet yet. So that is gonna make things worse as she tries to find a way to move on. Hopefully, she will make up for it soon. But the next time she tweets something so stupid that is not part of her ordeals, then、uh, you know it's time to vote her off, really.